Hey family, good morning and welcome back to a brand new day in my single mom life. Happy Saturday. Um, the kids and I are up and we're getting ready to have a little breakfast. Um, right now, I was just getting all of the kids things organized over here in what I'm going to call their back to school nook i guess back to school nook area which should be here in my laundry space and um i just wanted them to have a designated area where they know that they have all of their things backpacks school uniforms um and they can also put sneakers down below um and i can like you know spray everything and just kind of keep down on COVID-19 and other various uh, variants and little diseases that's been going around. Um, today we were actually supposed to go back to school shopping, but I'm going to hold off and do that. Later this week, we're going to go back to school shopping for clothes is what I was going to say. So we've taken care of their supplies and, and the only thing that I want to go and get is like some extra clothes that they can wear um, when they can dress out of uniforms and then I want to get them some new uniforms. and. Um, I am going to share with you guys their sneakers. I'm going to let them share with you their sneakers, okay? So stay tuned for that. But they got pretty much what they need to get started. Now, with Julian's school, which I'm hoping the name of his school wasn't just revealed, um, here is their collar shirt, one of them. And I'm probably going to blur out, I'm probably going to blur out the name on his shirt. I'm almost sure. But with Julian's school, he has to wear their collar shirt their sweatshirt their sweater shirt everything that he wears has to have their school logo on it and he can only wear khaki pants this year to uh his middle school his school color is um royal blue and khaki that's it um trade school they can wear red blue and white khaki black or blue pants so that's pretty cool but um I was kind of like, uh, because the schools were a little picky this year as far as like what the kids can and cannot wear. I guess they're keeping down on like COVID and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, it was just kind of a uh, little finicky just trying to figure out like, okay, do I go ahead and go shopping today? Do I go ahead and go shopping today and just go ahead and get the things or do I just hold off? So I think I'm just going to hold off on back to school clothing shopping because I want to make sure I get the right color uniforms and I want to make sure that when I do go get their regular clothes that they can wear when they you know are able to dress out of uniforms that they like the stuff that they have but again stay stay tuned for their sneaker haul and um yeah my kids wear uniforms so there's not really much to see with that <laughs> so um we're getting ready to start breakfast is what I was about to say so good morning Trey came in here and he started to pour him a bowl of French toast crunch. So I'm just going to move that over to the side. That's what they wanted for breakfast. Um, I actually wanted to do... Oh, it's okay, mama. It's okay. Zara's right behind me in her high chair, you guys. Um, so as a matter of fact, before I do this haul, because I had went out and got her some new, some new baby uh, food items, let me go ahead and get her... Yeah, Mama, let me go ahead and get her situated with her bottle, and I'm probably going to give her an avocado for breakfast. I like to use my Parent Choice Bottle Warmer to warm up baby girl's bottle. So I'm getting ready to give her 8 ounces of milk, and then I'm going to give her some of these avocado slices. And here's some other baby food that um, I want her to go ahead and utilize throughout the week. So we have some frozen carrots here, some more avocado that's frozen. We have some white potatoes that's frozen, some bananas. I know they don't look very appetizing, but they are bananas. And then I made her some um, some homemade blueberries. So yeah, this is all of her frozen baby food. So let me go ahead and make her bottle and give her an avocado slice for breakfast. Okay, 
Okay, baby. Hi, Mama. Hi. Hi. Okay. And now it goes on. Get here. Here. Baby's iron bottle is still going. I'm going to go ahead and get her bed going right now. And then. This dishwasher is all over the place. When the kids come, they just, you never know what you're gonna get with kiddos. Um, oh, she's working on her stars. So I'm gonna clear some of her stars out and go ahead and set her plate up. Good morning, fellas. Good morning. She enjoying that. How's everybody doing this morning? We're even sitting in this crutch. You eating cinnamon toast crunch, yeah. <laughs> I was just telling well, about that. French toast crunch. French toast crunch, right? Can somebody get the milk French toast. toast. Mm. Huh? That's it. There you go. <laughs> you all um, are not in the way. I can go ahead and give them the baby haul <laughs> of your sister's baby food. Look at the little elephant. Yeah. Wow, look at all this. Good morning, Judy. Good morning. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> Mmm, avocado. Our car is gonna break down. That's your mama personal favorite. That's your mama personal favorite, yeah. Avocado. <laughs> this is baby Zara's second time having avocado. She's had a parade and she has had the slices before. Say so this is my breakfast. So I'm gonna nibble and eat you know what i can and then i'm going to get me a full bottle mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah say so, yeah avocado 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 and i notice that she picks up things with her left hand so she may be a lefty like her big brother jew Good job, Mama. Good job. You're doing so great, Princess. Good job. So, you guys, I'm going to slide Zara over just a bit and get in the pantry. I have to organize my kitchen for back to school, so please ignore all of this. But there is a little chicken that I want you guys to see that um, Trey was so excited about. Now that Zara's starting solids, he was like, Mom, she can have chicken. And he picked this out for her in the store. I was cracking up. I said, when she starts chicken, baby, I'm gonna shred it and give it to her a different way. But I got it just to satisfy his excitement. So funny, right? So <gasps> You funny. actually got it. I'm not sure if we'll ever try it. I'm sure she will to see how she like it. But um, yeah. <laughs> I thought it was like the cutest thing. And then um, baby Zara was just looking like, oh, okay, chicken. <laughs> she is wearing that avocado out, you guys. She likes avocado. Uh-huh. All right. The boys are hanging out um, in the living room space. There's Trey. <laughs> And Juju's over there, but they are growing um, veggies. Julian is growing a lettuce, and Trey is growing a zucchini. Um, the reason you see it in this plastic bowl, which it doesn't go in, 
we have to go get the extra pottery for it um, is because I didn't have any pottery here. Um, we got these little miniature bags from um, the library when we went to the library the other day. And it came with the pot, the soil, seeds, and the little name tags. And um, I can't wait to see like the lettuce once it's done growing. drenching in, in sweat it is like probably 80 or 90 degrees outdoors and I am soaking wet um, baby girl just woke up and here are the boys say hey boys hey, yeah hey, and um, we're in the market um, I came downtown to their city market and the boys are gonna go play roughly 10 minutes because I think that it's way too hot even for baby girl like look at this oh my goodness i was thinking maybe we should have came out like around mm, 5 36 o'clock because right now it is about 1 32 o'clock i'm over here by the fresh vegetables and fruit and i should have um i think i'm gonna get this bag of broccoli for rent right here i like the way they got it labeled i think i'm gonna put some of these labels on zara's uh organic food that i'll be making her at home but um i really like how they got their fruits and veggies sitting out at the market um, so I'm going to grab a bag of broccoli while I'm in here and um, some tuna fish. I wanted to get some tuna fish and the kiddos will probably grab tuna fish as well or probably some lunch. made it to downtown Memphis there's baby girl here's the area where we are really quickly I'm doing a quick overview because it rained last night totally forgot you guys and the main park is over there which I may not get any footage because my phone is about to die but it's muddy like look how wet it's hey family we've made it back home I am so sweaty and tired I'm getting ready to give baby girl her bottle so she can go down for a nap and the boys are getting ready to eat a few things that they got from the market. And I'm going to show you guys in just a second. Julian picked out a sandwich and Trey ended up picking out tuna fish just like me. And I think everybody, I think we're all going to go down for a nap. I'm going to also go ahead and get ready to prepare dinner for tonight. I'm going to show y'all what I'm making. I'm actually going to put on a um, chicken ranch casserole. A chicken bacon ranch barbecue casserole. Yeah. So I'm going to show y'all how I do that. Probably voice over it since... Baby girl is going down for a nap and then I got a shower. I am, listen, when it's hot like that, baby, you gotta take three, four showers, do what you gotta do, okay? <laughs> but I'm gonna show y'all real quick what I'm making for dinner and what we got at the market. Um, I went on and tackled my little tuna fish. <laughs> it was tuna fish, cheese, grapes, and crackers in there. Um, here's the broccoli florets, which would be really great for the boys and also for baby girl, for baby led weaning. Um, I did get a Smart Water uh, Strawberry Blackberry. These Smart Waters are really good, too. And then the boys, they got them some water. This one is Julian's. Trey drank his already. And there's Baby Girl's bottle. Go give it to her in just a second. Um, but this is what the tuna fish package looked like. It comes with tuna crackers, cheese, and grapes. 
So that's Trey. When um, he saw me getting tuna fish, he was like, I want tuna fish too, mama. And then Julian got a sandwich. And it comes with, I think, mayo and mustard packages. It's a Chipotle chicken sandwich. So yeah, um, that's pretty much what we got at the market. Baby girl is crying. So I gotta go take her her bottle. Do you feel better now? Do you feel better now? Say so this is the safest place for mommy to put me while she cooks dinner. I'm gonna take me a nice nap. I also got my first ponytail in my hair. Ooh. <laughs> With baby Zara going down for a nap, I had to go ahead and voice over this real quick, but I'll show you guys how I made this casserole on tomorrow. I love y'all and thank you for watching.